Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we'll be seeing chapter 2 of the entire science textbook, which is components of food. So now we'll be seeing some components of food. Okay, carbohydrates and fats provide energy to the body. So uh, the fats provide more energy than carbohydrates. Proteins are bodybuilding foods. Vitamins are uh, essential for the proper functioning of the body. Uh, minerals are helpful for strengthening bones, teeth, and uh, they uh, help uh, like in increasing the function of the blood and the thyroid gland. Okay, guys. So vitamin, uh, I mean, yeah, vitamin B one, uh, B two, B six, and B twelve are together known as B complex. Some important minerals are potassium, iron, calcium, iodine, phosphorus, and sodium. Okay guys, so the next component is water. Water is essential for us and we can't live without water. Okay guys, so now we are going to be seeing some functions of water in our body. Okay, water carries uh, the essential substances like digested food and hormones in the body cells. Okay guys, and it also helps in removing waste from our body. And water contains, I mean it controls the controls and uh, regulates the body temperature. So it maintains our temperature. Alright guys, we come to our last component of food which is roughage. It is uh, an indi indigestible di dietary fiber which means it is a fiber that is eaten by us but cannot be digested by us. A balanced diet is a diet which contains all the nutrients, water and roughage in right amount. Okay guys, so now I will be talking about deficiency diseases. If you don't have all the nutrients in the right amount, you get a deficiency disease. Alright guys, so Kaushyakar is lack of protein, Marasmus is lack of protein and carbohydrates, uh, Night Blindness is lack of vitamin A, Beriberi is lack of vitamin B1, uh, Scurvy is uh, lack of vitamin C, Rickets is a lack of vitamin D, Goiter is lack of iodine and Anemia is lack of nine. Now we come to the final topic of the lesson which is Obesity. So Obesity is a diet that contains high calorie, fu calorie food with new, uh, less nutritive value some examples for the foods of obesity which give obesity are like sugary drinks uh, burgers pizzas fried items oily items so you better avoid this thing so that you don't get obesity okay guys so thank you guys for watching and make sure you subscribe bye